things that can be shaken will be shaken so that the things that cannot be shaken will remain everything else will be shaken your family will be shaken your life will be shaken your future will be shaken your career will be shaken your churches will be shaken your ministry will be shaken you yourself will be shaken only one thing will remain till the end your complete childlike faith in the Lord that is why the Bible says strengthen the things that remain ostracized other I gotta hang out here homiletically because I'm sure some of y'all came here today wondering what I would have to say about what was said by the president of the United States this past week well I want to juxtapose what Pharaoh decreed to what the president decreed the president remembered that when on January the 20th he lifted this nation by raising his hand of 2009 and took the oath of office don't forget that he was sworn to uphold protect and defend the Constitution of the United States which was born out of a declaration of independence do you know the words of the Declaration of Independence we hold these truths to be self-evident that all men all people are created equal I gotta hang out there notice it does not say that all straight men are created equal it does not say that all men unless you are gay and lesbian are created equal he swore upon oath to uphold protect and defend the Constitution not the Bible president for that now I recognize there were those who were upset about this I recognize that because I can't believe how many conference calls I was asked to participate in this week to discuss what the president had talked about but what the president said first of all take a chill pill take a deep breath everything's gonna be all right you are not going to lose your 501c3 if you do not marry a same gender loving couple I got a question for you why are you so upset why did it bother you so why were you so emotional that you had to clothe your anger with the Bible and justify your bigotry with scripture why did you have to do it I gotta hang out here because you do know and I'm gonna lose some of y'all right now we often major in what Jesus minored in have you ever read the gospel and heard Jesus say anything about homosexuality I'm with Kelly Brown Douglas black folk can't even deal with homosexuality because we got issues with sexuality